In our next problem, what if the missing is the principal? Let's try to solve the problem. Steve borrowed money from bank at the rate of 5.25% compounded annually. If his loans accumulated to 180,500 pesos after 3.5 years, how much did Steve borrow? So write all the given. We have first the rate, the R, 5.25%. That is 0.0525. Let's move twice to the left. And compounded annually, that is our K. Annually, so 1. Accumulated loan is 180,500. So that would be our future value or F, 180,500 pesos. And our time, 3.5 years, so 3.5. Now, since we have the formula here, so we're just going to write the formula. F all over 1 plus R over K raised to KT. Notice that it came in our future value formula. So just derive the formula if you don't know this one. Now, since we have a formula, we're going to substitute the given. So P is equal to F is 180,500 all over 1 plus R over K. R 0.0525 all over k is 1 raised to kt 1 times t is 3.5 now you can just press that in your calculator it's like this one so find this function in your calculator then type 180 1500 or insert that then parenthesis 1 plus then the function 0 0.0525 over 1 then close parenthesis raised to 1 times 3.5 is 3.5 then the equal sign. So the principal is 150,903.68 pesos. Of course, don't forget the pesos. Sign. So Steve borrowed 150,903.68 pesos in the bank. Then after 3.5 years, with 5.25% interest rate, the accumulated loan will be 108500 So, next will be, what if the missing is the rate? So we're going to use this formula. Stay tuned for our next example.